Hello friends, it's me Doom, and today we're playing Fishing Planet. There's been a massive update that, um, well, it, it uh, adds fishing boats, it adds, it adds to the species list of every single lake. There is uh, large amounts of good stuff that, uh, that has also been added. Um, now, as, as usual, whenever an update comes out, I am uh, stuck out on a lake trying to earn my money back, and that's kind of where I'm at right now, but uh, I do intend on buying a motorboat when I can, and that'll be cool. Oh, there we are. Oh, crap. Ah, it's public. I don't want public. I don't think nothing wrong with public, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna just uh, do that. There we are. So we're out on uh, we're out on Sander Bagarsi, Sander Bagarsi Lake, and um. We're just going to call it Sandbags from now on, because I don't know if it's actually pronounced Sander by Garcy. But, yeah. But, like I said... Wait, am I going the right place? Let's see. Doop, doop, doop. Uh, uh. Still kind of new here. Still learning the ropes. There we go. Fields of gold is where I'm headed. So, like I said, um, I will be getting a boat as soon as I possibly can. Because, you know... It's actually kind of cool. I was in the middle of trying to learn how to catch... Uh, what are they? Silver carp, big head carp, and all that other stuff. When this... When I found out that there was an update. So, I think that's what I'm going to still attempt to go after during this video. That seems right, or is it the next one? I feel like it's the next one. So big head carp and silver head carp um, are yes, yeah, so it's this one. That's the one. And we found here. Now a lot of there is a lot added in this update, including a new uh, I want, new missions, new missions that make sense. Instead of just random, here's how you start. Goodbye. It's more mastery of all the different uh, fish types, kind of. Like there's uh, one for mastery of pike, one for mastery of carp, one for mastery of, you know, you get it, bass. Um, like 12 or so. And there's also exploration missions, one for every lake. Hey, so you did! Welcome, Cedric. After this cast, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what's up with the... with that, with the mission situation. <clears throat> Still learning about these fish, so don't expect maybe necessarily a lot of action. I'm just trying to figure out what all works. Though we know that they're vegetarians, the silver carp and the big head carp. We know that they're large. And yeah. We know that they're here. That's about all we know. <clears throat> <clears throat> <clears throat> So if anyone's been out to Sander by Garcy, then, um, and has some pro tips for me for this lake, I'd love to know them. This is actually my first time out here. I just reached level 42. Um, yeah, that would be good to know. Very calm lake, I can tell you that. Low oxygen. 
Not a lot of moving water or plant life. What I really need to figure out how to do is tench. Tent, tetch? Tench, yeah. They're kind of the European equivalent of, of sport fish bass. Okay, so, oh, crap. I started reeling it in and something friggin' nibbled at it. Dang it. What I'm beginning to think is this might be a fish that might be best uh, for if you have multiple rods out in the water. There's surface feeders. We also know that. All these are surf surface feeders. I am fine, Mr. Hutchins. There we are. Oh, god dang it. Get it. Just take it. Yes. Oh, that's a lot of, that's a lot of stress. Okay. So we finally got one. And uh, this guy's kind of big. That's a good thing. They're lining me out. That's also a good thing. Oh, let's see this guy. I can't wait. If this guy's anything less than 15 pounds, I'm going to be very disappointed. Hello, Krista. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, I saw a little bit of his body. I can tell it's exactly what, we, what we're going for. Uh, I just don't know too much about the fish. Uh, both Big Head and Silver Carp. Uh, they're pretty similar in size. Silver being the, uh, the larger of the two, I believe. Oh, yeah. Okay, not horrible when it comes to money. Really good when it comes to XP. I'm going to keep them. Actually, I, I'm going to take a picture. Possibly for a... Uh, yeah. Wait, all right, how do I take it? Center, hide, exit. Oh, right, I'll just, yeah. Hide and F12. Oh, you can see the, uh, ha! It was just like... Let's get a little bit closer if we can. There we go. F12. That's a pretty fish. Other than those weird eyes. Let's see here. Get my live chat going back so I can see all your wonderful, lovely messages. And exit. And keep. <clears throat> Alright, so let's take a look at some of those messages, or some of those missions that they added with this new update. But before that, because I haven't gotten into it yet. Oh yeah, let's do missions first. Alright, so like I was saying, there's mastery of each species. We have crappy... We have uh, pike, trophy bass, fresh bait, oh, you, white drum, uh, let's see, yeah, freshwater drum, red drum, catch the drum, 33.1 pounds or more. Uh, let's see, uh, trophy trout, gar, carp, trophy catfish, trophy carp. And then the exploration missions, Lone Star Exploration. So, let's see. For these exploration missions, what it is, is 
uh, travel to Lone Star Lake, open up the fish menu, that's easy enough to do, catch white crappie, catch red ear sunfish, catch green sunfish, catch bluegill, uh, catch golden shiner, catch blacktail shiner, and you get, you get a snazzy pear-shaped float for that. Uh, travel to... Yeah, you get it. It's, it's that kind of deal. You... Yeah. You get all kinds of cool rewards for him, too. Unlike the last, you know, thing. <clears throat> you get actual physical rewards. So... That being said, I wanted to let you guys know, as it is now time for an announcement, I wanted to let you guys know that I really appreciate you guys showing up to these live streams and watching my videos and all sorts of other stuff. And uh, I do it absolutely for free. That being said, that might be, yeah, that's fine. Some of the software I use is not free. And if you enjoy these videos in such quality that I give them to you, you might might consider donating a dollar or two by hitting that super chat button. All right, I'm done begging. All right, let's go ahead and catch a few more of these guys and see what else this lake has to offer. I brought I brought shiners. There are pike here. Uh huh. It looks like we've already got a customer. This one looks substantially smaller than the last. That's okay though. Hopefully it's a silver, and I'll be able to compare which one of these uh, superficial super uh, surface feeder are. Uh, better per pound it is let's see here so keep now let's take a look and see which one of these is actually more efficient money wise so we've got a 15 pound worth yeah 877 Huh, that's actually... okay. Well, they're about the same. But I'd have to say, just not pulling out a calculator, just roughing it off the top of my head, that uh, the big head is worth a bit more per pound. Well, let's see, crap. 15... hold on, let's see here. 15... 800... 16, um, 24, well, no, I think the silver is, crap, I don't know, but either way, there you have it, it's one of those, we'll figure it out, obviously, before the video, grab a few more of these guys, <clears throat> the best part about them, though, is that the, uh, the bait is cheap. It's cheap bait. After this one, we'll go review another another bit about the uh, another bit about the update. Give me just a moment. I have limited time today. I do have to work today, so uh, I'm gonna. Still try to get my money's worth out of this, uh, what is it, out of the, uh, the duber. Out of the license, there we are, that's the one. So for those of you just joining us, we are going today to be talking about the update and two species of fish, at least two species of fish, we might be going after a third or a fourth, uh, out here on Sanderbagersi, something along those lines, and yeah, we're also going to be discussing new things 
We just talked about the new mission setups for the new update. Oh, got some action. Take it. And we're going to be taking a look at a few other things. Ah, dang it. Wasn't done yet. That's what I got. Alright, so after that, like I said, after that cast, we'll check out a few more things about this update. And that is to include, give me a sec here, some items in the shop. Which I just realized I'm not at the home shop, so they might not actually have it. So we're going to go to lures. You have jerk baits and minnows now. That's a new thing. Ah. Let's see here. There we are. Yeah. This easy to use and versatile jerkbait is made out of virtually unbreakable, high quality plastic with some advanced engineering in mind. The hard flat sided b hard yeah, okay. The hard flat sided body with two treble hooks is perfect for a jerking or twitching or a stop and go style of retrieve, mimicking the movement of a typical bait fish. When it comes to fishing for bass, pike, and especially muskies, Jerkbait are among the best baits at any time of year. Alright, so that's good to know. We finally have something for possibly specifically going after pike. That's good. Um, let's see here. It is a sinking bait. Most of these baits are sinking baits. So that's a different thing. We've had floating baits before. And I need to not do that because I'm using a controller. There we are. Let's see, these, okay, okay, well, I, I said that, okay, so, the runners sink to a, a depth, and then these uh, hunched runners float, and they work just like crankbait, so that's pretty interesting, uh, but these minnows, these minnows are really freaking cool. I kind of want to buy one, but I kind of want to make my money back first. So it's time to get back to fishing. Let's go ahead and grab another one. So how are you guys doing? Anything new and interesting? <laughs> Excuse me. Don't worry, it's on its way. Um, I've already checked the uh, the update logs. Uh, I didn't have I said TBA to be announced. Didn't have a very specific time on it, but you will be getting it. It will include new species in every lake. Uh, new missions, new mission types, and of course motorboats. And the thing that we just covered, uh, new tackle types. As well as some brand new equipment which we haven't covered yet. Which we might here in a bit. Ha! You wish. Speaking of which, what mic am I coming in through? Crap. I've got like four mics. I haven't even checked. Okay, good, 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 good. All right. Looking good. Ugh. All right, not having any luck. Gonna reel it in. Uh, and of course, it jiggled right as I, uh, as I started to reel. 
Let's us cast a little bit over here. I did just wake up, so I'm a little bit more Space Ghost than I am announcer at the moment. Zorak, play me to the desk. Come on, do something. Please? Well, while we're waiting for this next bite, and we'll be reviewing something new about the... Or checking to see if there's anything new, specifically, on this update, uh, after this cast, let's talk about a little bit of channel news, since I got y'all here. I have officially written a schedule. Uh, an actual schedule. That I will be keeping to, I'm sure, because I don't know. Uh, I mean, I hope I will. Um, so, here's the plan. We start the week on Monday with free-to-play Monday, obviously. On Thursday, so I get those tasty, those tasty Friday views, too. Oh, hold on. We do a follow-up video, take it. All right, there it is. Do a follow, ooh, gosh, big one. Do a follow-up video, eh, not so big, okay. On the same game that I did free-to-play Monday on. Oh no, he's lining me out, no he's not, okay. And then Saturday, or Sunday, yeah, Saturday. Well, hello, you. I like him. Look at him. He's a little derpy. He's a little derpy. Not gonna lie, but I still like him. I'm gonna go ahead and take another picture. Then Saturday, we we reserve Saturdays for for Fishing Planet and other series videos. Not necessarily Fishing Planet every uh, every Saturday, but you know, something cool. Oh, hold on. Let me do the do. Uh, I need to get rid of this text box, and then I need to... F12. Boop. Another thumbnail for a video. Now, another thing that they added... I am going to get this going. Another thing that they added is... Um, let's see, what is it? Right, UI changes. Now, they're a little bit, they did something a little weird, and it took me just a moment to, to, uh, get around it. Now, I'll have you know, for those of you who use a controller, that release, I swear, used to be A, and keep used to be B. Like, I'm not crazy, right? That's a thing? I mean, obviously, for those of... Uh, it'd be reversed. It'd be, what, X and and Circle for you PlayStationers? So, Circle would have been uh, to keep, and then X would have been to... Uh, yeah, X would have been to... Yeah, release. But they, they swapped it around, so be careful. Be on your guard. Or else you're going to be an idiot like me and lose the first five fish because you didn't read Jack. So how am I doing money-wise? Inventory. Yeah, four grand, five grand almost. Okay. God, I gotta get a big keep net. Ah, no, no. Oh, God, no. Okay. Okay, so here's the thing. These fish 
are great experience, but they're not so good with money. Speaking of fish, they added new fish species to every lake, so interesting things. Not necessarily new species, but they did add some from other places to other places, and so that's good. And, uh, ooh, my timer says it is now time for another announcement. And today's announcement is brought to you by the letters IRL. Fishing Planet IRL. Fishing Planet IRL, which, for those of you who didn't actually catch the, uh, the update where I talked about it, is going to be a competition between two teams. It's going to be f Team Real Life versus Team Fishing Planet. It's going to be taking place on a real lake, which, by the way, is currently being named by you guys. If you haven't seen the Fishing Planet IRL announcement, which is the name of the video, then go in, head in, and vote on, or not necessarily vote, give me your suggestion, or thumbs up a, a, uh, a lake name that you like down in the comments below. Anyway, two teams are going to be going after... Well, let's see, I've been watching a Fishing Planet tutorial videos for over a year. I'm 45, and I thought I would let you know, but I don't comment much. Well, I appreciate it. I mean, I, I literally created these, uh, created these videos specifically with you and people like you and mine. So, I, if, uh, if you enjoy them, then I, I enjoy you enjoying them. And you don't have to leave a comment. But don't forget, thumbs up help too. That being said, if you guys like this stream, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. Oh, oh, got a fish! Got a fish! Nope, nope, that's too early. Okay, there we go. Almost jumped the gun. I don't know where this energy is coming from this morning. I, like, I haven't, I haven't even had coffee yet. I'm down though. If this is what it's like to be fully rested, my god. Anyway, like I was saying, Fishing Planet IRL challenge or tournament, I haven't decided what exactly it is, is going to be two teams. A real life fishing team versus a Fishing Planet uh, team, captained by yours truly, going after two species of fish. One person from each team will be tackling predatory fish. One, te one team member from each team will be going after omnivorous fish. Specifically catfish in this case. Um, and we will see which... Well, that's a big guy. I'm liking the silvers better money-wise, for sure. Anyway, we'll, we'll see who becomes victorious. Team Fishing Planet will use strategies... Only from Fishing Planet, whereas real life, the team real life will, you know, yeah, be actually fishing using real fishing strategies. And we'll see just who comes out on top and just and see just how how accurate the real fishing simulator or the, the ultimate fishing simulator actually is. So you guys... Be on the lookout for Fishing Planet IRL Challenge coming up soon. And we're going to be filming it this month, or early next month, in the peak of bass spawning season. That being said, I'm not going to let you know what, uh, what all is coming up species-wise on that, other than catfish. There will be catfish involved, but, I mean, I'm pretty sure you can guess. I'm going to tell you one thing for sure. I'm going to be completely disappointed if I get anything less than a thousand views on that. <laughs> Spend all that time with all those cameras, with uh, with all those audio and video sources to edit in. and Because each person's going to have their own mic, too. That's the thing. Um, yeah. All right, so we've talked about, for those of you who just joined us, a few new things, a few new updates for this game. Motorboats, 
Um, well, actually, we haven't talked about motorboats yet. But we have talked about new, let's see, minnow lures. Yeah, runner lures, hunched runner lures. Uh, there are new fish in each area. There are new, uh, let's see here. Let's see, new fish in each area, new missions. There we go, that's the other big change. New missions that make sense and have actual good rewards this time, not just day passes. But you get like really cool lures and bobbers and hooks and, and such. And they're mostly silver too, which is kind of cool. And spoilers, guys, my personal... Uh, I say personal favorite, my fir my the one I'm the most famous on YouTube for, there we go, that's the one, uh, is, is obviously St. Croix, and I've already got the St. Croix one done, obviously. Um, the St. Croix gives you a, the exact lure that I use, but in, in a silver, shiny format. So, like, a special one. So that's interesting, I... I don't see exactly how it would be used there, though, because you'd need dark colors for it to, for my method to work. But I don't know. We'll t we'll try we'll try it out uh, in a future live stream, probably next week, next Friday, next Saturday, maybe. Come on! All right, bringing you in. Oh God! Okay. I need fish. You get that, right? You give me fish, and I will give you uh, a video review. There we are, obviously. So, my timer is going off again. It now says that it is time for me to let you guys know. Uh, let's see. We did the channel PSA. We did the upcoming Fishing Planet IRL announcement. Right. That's what it was. I really enjoy making these videos for you guys. And I really enjoy that you enjoy them. Oh, wait, hold on. Us PS4 players are always last to get the update. Unfortunately, yes. But that gives me an opportunity to get you guys ready for, uh, for the upcoming update with, with, uh, with shiny new videos. Uh, let's see. What lake am I at? I'm at level... 42 Lake Sander Bagersi, or Sander Bagersi, or I'm not sure exactly how to say it, so we're just going to call it Sandbags. It's over in Europe, and we're going after Silver Carp while we're talking about uh, Silver Carp and Big Head Carp. Do you know when the update comes out? It is TBA at the moment, to be announced. Unfortunately, um, yeah, not yet, I don't. But as soon as I do, believe me. I will be I will be announcing it on a live stream. Okay, come on you. Get back over here. Anyway, let's see here. I really enjoy making these videos for you guys and helping you all out. And I do it for free, but some of the software I use is not free. If you'd like to help me pay for my expenses and support the channel, you know... Feel free to use that super chat button and donate a dollar or two. Okay, I'm done begging. Don't click away. That's it. Let's see. All right, you know what? I'm done with this. I'm done with it. I'm done. We're going after another species. One I know absolutely nothing about. I've paid for my day. All right, so we are going after. Let's bring this guy back up. And go to the fish species. That's not the fish species. There we are. So how big do bream get? 11 pounds. Interesting. Anyway, that's not what we're going after. We are going after... Wait, how big do these guys get? This actually should be pretty good, good, uh, good money. Rarely grow over 5.3 ounces. Okay, yeah. Not worried about it. But we are... Let's see. Leather carp. Mirror carp. 
And where are you, Tench? There you are. So Tench, our fi our uh, our our bait, yeah, bait fish only. Let's see here. Crawfish cut, blood worms. I have got blood worms, red worms, leeches, night crawlers. Okay. So where do we find them? Freshwater game fish, the carp family, commonly found throughout Europe and Asia, is, spe is specific. It specifically, sorry, tends to inhabit slow-moving lakes, rivers, preferably of clay and mud, abundant vegetation, low oxygen levels. Okay, low oxygen levels. Gotcha. Um, so that means no, not a lot of flowing water. Um, not a lot of surface vegetation, you know, that kind of deal. Uh, let's see here. Tench looks somewhat similar to carp and is distinguished by their plump bodies with very small scales, olive green skin, and square shaped tail fin. Oh, yeah, so it is. Uh, let's see. These fish usually grow lengths about two to two and a half foot, or one to two point two feet and weigh an average of five through seven pounds, but the record fish caught in England weighed almost 15 pounds, which is actually pretty impressive for a fish shaped like that. I'm just saying. Tents are nocturnal. Okay, that's, that's good. We know that they're nocturnal. They're predators feeding mostly on plankton, insects, small crustaceans, and invertebrates. So we are going, I've got blood worms. I've got red worms I think maybe leeches so they are invertebrates they are invertebrates <laughs> they are nocturnal that's the one um okay so they are nocturnal they are vertebrates as it turns out they have spines and bones and vertebrae uh right inventory backpack I need to see what all I have in the way of... Okay, I got the blood worms. Good. Ugh. Still only have 33,000. So, um, hang on, what's my turn in? Okay, that'll put me about, back up to 40,000. You know, this is not a bad... These guys are not bad money earners. I, I'm, I'm kind of kind of loving them, but they're slow to catch. And you know how I am about slow to catch. Not a big fan. Um... Yeah, good experience, though. Let me double check something. Right, so. Well, let's go to shop. Let's us grab some bait. Uh, nope, just kidding. Lures. Nope, baits. Yep, sorry. Okay, insect common baits. Fresh baits. Okay, was it insect baits I need? Crap. That's common, right? No? Insect? Okay, I will have you know that leeches are not insects. I'm just saying. Okay, but let's grab some. Let's grab some red worms. And let's grab some night crawlers. All right, so if I were a a vertebrate and a, a night a night fish, a fish of the night that enjoyed low oxygenated water, I would be here in a little alcove. So let's us Well, let's see here. Did I get that backwards? Oh. Hold on. This map is a little confusing. Forgive me. Here. There we are. Okay. Okay. You know what? I'm going to try them here first. There we go. That sounds like a good, solid plan. And what's the night look like? 
Oh, it looks like it sucks, actually. Well... I guess we'll start at 9 p.m. So how are you guys doing? Doing good, I hope. Nine... <laughs> Just kidding, that's way too far p.m. So let's learn us a thing or two about this tench situation. Let's start out with some night crawlers. And I'm going to start each of these at maximum depth. Oh, 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 oh. And just for the sake of visibility, I mean, I can see it fine, but specifically for the stream. Boop. Ah, this isn't right, though. Is it? This is where we spawn. This isn't where we were just catching. Okay, hold on. We're gonna make a little trek. Now, this is where we were. Yeah, okay. I'm just an idiot. But that, no, crap. Okay, we're going over there. There we go. This is where we need to be. This is the spot. I think. I've got no clue. So we're going to set it out to max drag, cast it right smack dab in the middle, and hope for the best. Or no, not max drag, but uh, max depth. There we are. See what happens. We need low oxygenation, an area with low oxygenation. That's stagnant water, by the way. And what could be more stagnant than the little branch of a branch? So stagnant, the bobber isn't even moving. Oh, we're, also, we're also actually resting on the bottom, too. That's no good. This actually might be a bottom feeder situation. A uh, bot uh, bottom fishing. Um, which is... I do not have a pole for that, unfortunately. Uh, as usual, I am exactly one update behind. Alright, so we will switch to 70 inches. Cast her back out and see if it rests on the bottom still. And it does. Okay. Forty inches. That's a bit far. Oh, that's fine. And does it rest on the bottom? I don't think it does. Good. All right. Bring him in a bit more. And we're going to see what tench like activity is going on here. Okay, I also need to check and see exactly what time it is, because I do have to work today. Give me just a moment. I'm sure I will have a bite as I'm checking the time. My phone is all the way over here. 12.30, okay, just still doing good. I missed anything. Crap. Okay. Nothing. Moving along. Actually, before we move along, I am going to be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. So, uh, <clears throat> just got to do a quick thing in another room. I'll be right back.
Alright, so this is going to sound a little weird. Especially for those of you who don't, uh, who don't do this kind of thing. There's a truck that was driving by. <clears throat> this guy sells produce out of the back of his truck. So I just bought a delicious mango for just a dollar. It was a good deal. I'm going to try over here. I've got better... I've got a better feeling about over here. This feels... This actually feels like a pike spot. If, I, if I'm seeing correctly all the way over there, there are uh, reeds and situations. And yes, there are pike here. But that's not what we're going after right now. If I can't make my money back from this trip, then yes, that's exactly where we're going. So have any of you tenched before? Have you caught tetch, tench, tetch? And if so, could you give me a hint? As I know nothing about this species other than the fact that it's a European delight. Um, and really fat. After this, we'll go and review a few things for the new viewers, a few things um, about the new update and whatnot. All these new fancy situations we got going on. Come on, bite. I'm not seeing any activity. All right, so let's try. I'm going to bring it in, and we're going to review those those new details, those new changes for patch for Fishing Planet version 3.0.1, the motorboat update. I'm seeing a lot of activity around here. I'm wondering if they're closer to shore. I don't know. Anyway. So, some of the new changes include new lure types, including, oh, jerkbait and minnows. Um, let's see. Yeah, I'll just use my mouse. Because, yeah. That just makes more sense. Jerkbait is a sinking, or, yeah, sinking minnow situation. Um, yeah, they sink. And uh, they're apparently perfect for pike, so that's good to know. The other new things include runners, or triple runners, I suppose, um, which they sink, but they sink to a specific depth um, instead of, like, let's say, you know, a crankbait, which floats, and then you, yeah. However, this stuff, the hunched runners work just like crankbait for some reason I can't say crankbait can't remember the word crankbait the deep runner another floating situation do we have any more examples deep runners hunched runners deep runners yep okay that's it for well what's available at this store let's see there's a heavy crankbait model Oh, I pike. Interesting. A slow, enticing wobble. And where'd it go? I just saw it. And just a slow and enticing wobble. That's usually what I look for. Anyway. Let's see. The other things that it comes with is boats. I doubt that there's any motorboats available on this lake. But there are. Okay, so. Motorboats. Now, these obviously aren't the only uh i want i want i want i want to to let you guys know that it says passenger capacity that says passenger capacity let that sink in for a moment now yes that says one but that means that there are boats 
that have more than one. Which means you can fish with your friends on your boat. I'm just saying. Anyway, so these guys are pretty cool. I like them. I'm going to get one. I would never got a kayak, but I'm going to get one of these. Um, now, uh, let's see. Besides boats, obviously, they also put in brand new missions. Mastery of different species of fish, as well as exploration missions. Just kidding. Where did we go? There we go. Of different lakes. All the different shiny rewards. See, I really want that. I've got something like that in real life. Which you will see on Fishing Planet Real Life. Or Fishing Planet IRL Challenge or Tournament. Which is something huge that's upcoming on this channel that everybody will absolutely love or I'll never make it again. Because <laughs> it's going to be a lot of work, guys. A lot of work. Oh, sweet. Alright, but yeah. So back to this, back to figuring out how tench work, how to tench, as I've never tenched before. I'm going to tench like I've never tenched before. I'm going to be casting a little bit closer to shore here. I'm going to be switching my bait. There we are. I'm going to be switching my bait from night crawlers. Hang on. To... And blood worms. There we are. I don't have much longer on this stream left, guys. I've got, I've got to, I've got to head out and actually do actual work and earn actual money instead of YouTube revenue, which is great and all, but I don't make a lot. Like for example, I'm making sixteen dollars this month. And it's costing me $33 this month just for the uh, just for the equipment to do these streams. And, uh, I mean, I can get a free streaming thing, but I enjoy quality and being able to see things and user functionality. But also the videos. The videos have to, in order to come out in such high quality, they have to come, they have to actually be done with an actual, an actual you know, premium program. So, it's a bit expensive. I'm running Fondoom Gaming at a loss. If you'd like to support the channel, of course, you can hit that super chat button, since I know y'all been waiting to the end of the stream to donate. You can donate to the channel. Help support this venture. I'm done begging. That's it. That's the last time this video. And I do appreciate super chats. Quite a bit. Now, let's see here. Before I go, though, hopefully I can get at least one nibble from... Oh, a nibble! <laughs> see that? And this is, it's a fish. A sod. Maybe I need a smaller hook. They're not that big. Anyway... Let's see here. I forgot what I was going to say. Okay. I'm bringing it in. I'm changing my hook size. To a number two odd. Number two seems reasonable for the size of fish we're going after. Ah, wrong button. Number two odd. I don't know why I didn't think about that before. There we go. Come on, come on back, fish. 
Just give me one. I want to catch one. Not for myself, but for the viewers. You can do it. Just think, fish. You could become a celebrity. All seven people in this stream could see you. <laughs> oh. It's not working, guys. Anyway, this species, I'm going to have to obviously do a little bit more research on. Although, I've got pretty much got the silver carp and the big head carp down to a science. So that's good. I'm a big fan of the way those fish work. Other than the slowness. All right, and I have to go get ready for work and spend eight hours inside of a box. As that is my job. I am a box person. So, thank you so much for joining me on today's stream. If you want to know more about any fish species, feel free to check out the playlist, the fishing playlist on this channel. Uh... If you can think of anything interesting down, be down below, let me know what you want to see more of in the comments and the such. If, if you'd like to help support the channel, leave a super chat right now. Because i think got about, about a minute left and stuff. I'm going to review how much all this other stuff. So now would be a good time if you're going to. Uh, we've got... Uh, let's see, I've caught four fish. That's a total of 113 pounds. Uh, and eight, let's see. So 113. So we're looking at about, for a mix of silver carp and big head carp, we're looking for every 100 pounds, about 6,800 for mix. Well, anyway, questions still remain. For example, is this a, an effective place to earn money? Is it an, an effective place to earn XP? Well, you can find out the answers to those and more on the next episode of Von Doom Gaming!